Okay, so I'm going to talk a little bit about the blood flow through the heart. Blood comes in through the cranial and the caudal vena cava. And the blood that comes in there is deoxygenated. So it's not carrying any oxygen. And it comes into the right atrium of the heart. Then it flows through a valve that has two different names. It's either called the right AV valve or the tricuspid valve. And from there it goes into the right ventricle. The right ventricle then contracts and the blood goes up through the pulmonary, well, either the semilunar or the pulmonary valve into the pulmonary artery, which takes the blood to both lungs. Um, The blood then comes back from the lungs after it's been oxygenated through the pulmonary veins, which enters the left atrium, then goes through the left AV, the bicuspid or the mitral valve, it's all the same thing, into the left ventricle. The blood then goes through the semilunar valve, which is on the aorta, or called the aortic valve, and the aorta transfers all the blood throughout the body where it drops off the oxygen and picks up carbon dioxide, and then the cycle starts again. The blood comes back into the cranial vena cava, into the right atrium, and it just starts all over again.